to thank our sponsors for uh, supporting us, not just today, but throughout the year. Ms. Uh, Dina Bynum, she couldn't be here with us today, but she is the administrator at Harvest Health and Rehab on Johns Island, and she sponsored the uh, float that the seniors and the Grand Marshal rolled on. I'd also like to introduce to you and ask him to come and give a few words Brother Darrell Dickerson from Dickerson's Marchery, he is a year-round supporter of the Community Center, the senior programs, and we're just so happy to have him here with us today. Good afternoon. It's good to be here again. Um, I like supporting the Warlock community. This is where my family is from, and I made a promise to the Lord that I can help anyone, I'm going to do what I can do to help you. I don't want to be a selfless person, I like to give or to receive, and you'll be blessed more like that. And I suggest that you all take the same advice. It's blessed to give, than receive. Once again, I thank you all for allowing me to come with you all once again, and hope to see you all again next year, may God bless you. Thank you, we love you Brother Dickinson. We also want to thank all of the uh, parade participants, uh, the uh, Johns Island Fire Department for being here with us today. Uh, we want to introduce to you uh, St. John's High School Queen for this year. She is from Johns Island, so she's still one of our own sister brothers. You want to say something to the crowd? She has a lot of competition at St. John's, so you know this is truly an honor for her and for us to have her here. Um, I just want to say hi. My name is Tarniqua Brothers. Um, this is my first time ever being in a parade, and I enjoyed it. Thank you. Her, both her, her mother and father are volunteers on the board here at the community center, and we thank them and grandmother for bringing them out. And I got a little ahead of myself. I asked uh, Reverend Capers, who was the pastor of Salem and Bethel Presbyterian Church, to give us a prayer. Now, you know, we know that is needed, so I'm going to ask Reverend Capers to come at this time and bless us in his own way. Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Happy Labor Day. Let us pray. Lord, how grateful we are and how grateful you are to allow us to celebrate a 12th year of Labor Day, family together, friends together, church together, community together, all coming together to know that we are all family and we are all one. Bless this day, bless everyone that have come, bless all of the activities and bless the food that uh, have been prepared for us and as we purchase them, we do it in love. In Jesus' name we pray. Let everybody say amen. 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 Let's enjoy ourselves on this Labor Day now. Thank you, Reverend Capus. We also want to um, not introduce, but present to you Miss Anna Johnson, who is our voice on County Council. We thank her for being here today. And we want you to know that Miss Johnson is really your voice on County Council anytime we call her. She Good afternoon, everyone. It's an honor for me to be here today and help you celebrate your 12th year of this uh, parade. I had a great time, and you have such beautiful floats. I'll have to do something about that the next time. But uh, just want to ask you to please, uh, uh, during the month of September, think about coming to our roundtable discussion that's being held at the uh, Johns Island Library. We do that every fourth Wednesday. So look forward to seeing you there at 12.30 if you're able to come. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Johnson. And for those of you who have not registered to vote, we have a group inside from voters registration. If you just need to change your address, uh, we want you to go in, stop by the table, and speak to those people there. And again, on behalf of the board here at the Community Center, we thank you all for coming out today and supporting us, some of you not just today, but throughout the year. Thank you, and God bless you all.